Androids are looking extremely good this season. Yeah, yeah, I know. But what about Topku? Yeah, Topku makes everything seem like they're not doing great. But I'm telling you guys, if Topku didn't exist, you know what? Matter of fact, let them exist. Androids are eating this season. Let me show you this deck real quick. This is a very fun Android deck. Our big hitters are, you know, Broly. We got four of them. We have four Jero's Labs and we actually have four gigantic meteors. We don't have any destructive strength here because we're ramping with this bad boy and our other card right here are set to double androids. This thing is insane. You guys don't understand how good this is, which is why you're seeing a ton of these cards, like your one drop Android 20, your one drop Android 19, your two drops Androids. It doesn't matter. It's just pretty much so you can play or have a card to play on curve if you need to. That is an Android. So that way you can kind of maximize this or even just send them to your energy, right? Pretty much every card in here with the uh, exception of this guy, this guy and uh, this guy. And oh, yeah, don't forget this guy is pretty much an android right so a lot of value there and there is this tech you guys i'm trying to get it to work but it is hard because once we get there the opponents just surrender it's so frustrating but let, let me let me tell you what it is real quick we play the double androids we blow up their boards of three drops or less right we swing maybe we don't doesn't matter but on the following turn we can swing for four <laughs> life it's like a double double striker how this works is you swing with this double strike you hit you don't hit doesn't matter guess what we play this guy and then you discard a card and ko this card and you get to choose one of your android 17s and uh, switch them back to active and if you guys know anything about this game this card right here yeah it has both names it counts as android 17 and android 18 which is pretty nuts so i got a really nice gameplay for you guys showcased uh let me know what you think in the comments down below anyway let's jump right into it you guys all right looks like we're going up against zamasu at least it's not Topku. <laughs> all right starting hand Honestly, not looking too bad, but I think I'm going to have to mulligan this, to be honest. I need I need something a bit better. This would be great against top Q, right? This is also great. The uh, gigantic meteors, of course. Oh, this is looking a bit better. Now we just need to draw, you know, our Jero's lab or even that double Android again. And we're we're pretty much set, honestly. So for Zamasu, I think they kind of want to like last towards, they're more of a late game kind of player. Interesting choice. Interesting. All right, we're going to charge up this Android 18. We're going to shoot off an attack to see what our draw is. It's nothing crazy. I feel like interesting. I mean, I guess that makes sense. Typically, I see um, blue players, I guess it's only against red. They play a little more, you know, conservative, conservative. They try to prolong. I guess we'll take this. They try to prolong their, uh, presence in their life from drawing. So that's just something I've noticed more recently. Typically like green players do that because they want to ramp, right? Do so you want to stick around longer? Like you, <laughs> that's exactly what I'm about to do right here. I'm gonna right here. Just combo. No thank you. We're gonna keep our life as high as possible until we build up our energy. Interesting. What does this do again? It's been so long since I've actually like opened up the client. <laughs> what do we do here? Choose up to one of your Oh. Interesting. He just really wants to hit me. Okay. That's cool. I'll take it. Ooh, we're cooking. We're cooking. I'm going to hit him here. See what he goes for. He does anything crazy. Nothing. Okay, we'll drop this guy. And we'll go for a crit. I think this is pretty good, honestly. Next turn, it's looking like we'll play our uh, double androids here. Ooh, which one did we burn? We burned a Gawasu. Nothing crazy. All right. This is a good uh, starting, you know, couple turns, not gonna lie. <laughs> Got some nice 10k combos. Got these guys just in case. Yeah, I'm not mad. I am not mad at this. This is gonna be so nuts, dude. So 
So honestly, I think, um, what can they play at three? They could just bottom deck this with Vegito. So I think I give it to them. Nothing crazy. Their three drop, three drop Vegito. Pretty sure that bottom decks, right? Because it becomes a one drop. They're at seven cards. They were at six, so yeah, we'll take this. Okay. Nice, little big bosses. We've got some combo for later. Keep us alive. Keep this guy here. And there we go. Interesting choice. I need to just yet to be honest all right now we're at five yeah this is looking pretty good this guy here Ooh, nice 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 okay so we charge this I swing this guy try to get him off the Board. I wonder if he blocks for this. No block. So we might just go through. That's nice. All right, and now. Oh, it was a win KO'd. I read it as on play. Okay, that makes way more sense. Now we're gonna drop these big boss androids real quick. Activate the ability. Yes, please. Oh, it's only two, right? Oh, no. No, we're fine. We're fine. I'm pretty sure, yeah. And these three back here. And now what we can do is something crazy. And drop this down. Or I can play three. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm just going to put this. Play it. And then... End the turn here. By next turn, if they attack my leader, I'll be a 30k swing. And that's honestly pretty respectable. And then we still have Gigantic Meteor. Yeah, no, this is looking pretty good for us. They're on turn four. So yeah, once we get up to six, then I'll play like this here to get the extra draw. These are looking pretty good. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, let me see, oh yeah, our one card in our drop is an android already. Got the Gohan, let's go. Honestly, might even just play the Gohan next. We'll flip. Oh, this is my tech card. I'm so excited to give it a go. I'm so excited to try this one out, you guys. Uh yeah, let's see if it'll work. Uh I'm gonna I'm gonna combo out real quick. Oh snap, that's a 30k, I'm gonna have to use two of these guys, do I though, or do I just use the, yeah, we won't be using him, uh, or Android 18 next turn anyway, so, might as well cover it, okay, cool, now I'm gonna play this strategic, see what we draw into, super combo, not bad, we need this guy, although this could be very helpful for us, I'm gonna get rid of one of these, I'll charge. Okay. And then I'm going to use this ability real quick to send this. Now we're at 30k. Pretty pretty massive right here, right? Hmm. If we swing into you. Okay, we get the draw. I wonder if he blocks. No, he doesn't. He takes it. Interesting choice. Oh, he doesn't. Okay. I'm going to attack into you. I wonder if he takes this. 
He does. Awesome. We're in a good spot. That's pretty good. And now we'll play our Gohan to remove his four drop. He's at five, so he could play the S uh, secret rare Vegito or his five drop next turn. But honestly, we're pretty, we're big chilling right here. We are big chilling. Do I worry about this guy? Do I swing with him? Yeah, I'll swing. All right, and then end my turn here. The thing is, we're gonna have to play Android and keep them alive. I guess we could swing with the Android and waste their card advantage, but if they have something like Xeno, we're kind of screwed, right? I really want to make this work. So what I'm thinking is we play this, we swing with a double strike. If it goes through, we play this guy on the second turn when we have our energy back, choose up to one of your Android 17 cards and switch it to active mode. And since this is both 17 and 18, <laughs> we get to swing for four life on one turn, which is kind of nuts. Yeah, no, I think that that is the play next turn, which is pretty good. If we even make it next turn. Um, still have two more here. Uh, do I want to give them this? Yeah, that's fine. Honestly, not too bad. Not too bad at all, you know? Oh, and they're swinging into me with what? With what? Oh, they're just doing it for a draw. Okay. I'm telling you, androids are feeling pretty good. Into top coup, into pretty much anything. This is definitely their their season to shine. I'll, although they've been... Uh, oh, no. They've been outshined by the uh, top coup meadow. I think if Topku wasn't here and none of the red cards were here, th this would be the new insane threat on the block. So we'll see. Ooh, hold up, hold up, hold up. We might be able to do something. Let me see. I'm going to get rid of one of these guys. Okay. So I can use this, right? And I'll still be at seven. Let me see. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll still be at seven. We'll send this guy. And then when I play this, it'll get rid of four. So I'll drop down to three, but then I'll add three. I like it. it gives us a lot of value. Mm, but I also could just wait, right? I might, I might just wait, to be honest. Uh, yeah, I think I'll, <laughs> I don't want to. Because the thing is, if they Xeno me, then I lose two valuable cards. And that just seems silly. We'll get rid of these guys. I'm gonna swing into you. Oh, they surrendered! No! No, and I couldn't even do my tech. Anyway, I guess that's a win. Damn.